take about hey look though this time we're gonna go into straight meditation um because i have a list but i honestly don't know what to choose right now like i didn't want to go down the list because of certain things but here we are we're gonna meditate for three minutes okay and um we're gonna get into what my soul wants me to say on this okay so hey siri set timer for three minutes It's 1.55 on the clock. 1.55 p.m., y'all. I'm going to get a little closer to y'all because I know y'all want to see my pretty flies. You know what I'm saying? So, what what I'm marking off the list right now is everyone wants one thing, yo. And what could that be? I want you to ask. I want you to answer that question before I give you the answer. What is one thing that everyone wants? Don't think outside. Don't think material. One thing that everyone wants inside. What is it? Love. Everybody wants to be loved no matter how bad they try to act like they don't. No matter how bad a person push you off. No matter how bad a person reacts to the way that love hits them. You know what I'm saying? Just to bring that into to play, some people don't know what love feel like. Some people don't understand when love is around because they never witnessed love, right? Let's use me as an example back in the day. I, I, 
I could speak on this stuff because at the end of the day, I don't regret nothing that happened in my past. I don't regret. I don't have no um I don't have no bad vibes with nobody in the past. Like all this is happening for a reason. And once you all understand that, you wouldn't you wouldn't feel no way to nobody. You get what I'm saying? So like this, right? Back in my younger days, um I could say in a way that I wanted love, right? But I grew up off tough love, right? So it was like, uh, I'm there, but emotionally I'm not there. You feel me? So like, I didn't understand emotionally, unconditionally what love was until I stepped, out, stepped outside of the house, right? Crazy, right? And I'm not saying I wasn't loved or, you feel me, like, I was. I was taken care of, you feel me, earthly, you feel me? Um, but love. <laughs> Unconditional love that, I'm sorry, it wasn't in in there. It wasn't, I, would, I didn't grow up like that, bruh. I didn't. I had to learn that. And I did. <laughs> I did, you know, as y'all can see. Anyways, so love is very, very important. And it opened up my eyes a lot. Because when I went outside, okay, as you grow up, of course you're not you're not outside, you're not seeing the world because you're with your parents. You gotta be with your parents 24-7. You don't know what the hell going on outside for real. Okay, now that they got internet and all that stuff, you kinda know, but yeah, right? So I had to step outside of my home to see other people and the way that they love one another and I started to think like whoa what's wrong with me what's wrong with us <laughs> right and now I, I know a lot I know why now like I, that's why I cannot ever say that I have a bad vibe with anybody bro because I know I know trust me I know like I just know, right? So I don't ever point the finger and be like, you, you ruined my life. You, No, bro. It's just some people really don't know what love is, bro. And they got to learn it like everybody else, right? Um, some people grow up in a household with it. Some people have that generational love inside of their family already to where, where their parents loved on them and they loved they parent and they, I mean they love their kid and they kid love their kid and so on and so forth, right? But it's very, very important. As y'all can see, looking outside, bro, I wanna understand if everybody wants love, why is it so much hate? Huh? Answer me that, riddle me that real quick. I just need to know. You feel me? That's where I had to open my eyes at. Recently too though. Like that's why I say healing constantly comes into play. You forget some sh Oh, you gonna remember. You gonna remember, right? So with love and how it is, right? Like I said, everybody wants love, but we showing hate. I... I Piggybacking off of what I said on the last episode, people, the road rage, the, the video, it's so it's it's killings. Y'all wanna y'all wanna put the earthly things into play, right? It's killings. It's people on Instagram talking about one another. People on Facebook talking about one another. People judging one another. People segregated from one another, not helping one another. See a brother down, don't wanna pick him up. You get what I'm saying? Like it's a whole bunch of that on the internet right now, bro. And, and why not be that beacon of light and say, what are we doing, y'all? What are we doing? Don't we all want love? Why you stabbing her in the back? Why you stabbing him in the back? Why you cheating on her? Why you cheating on him? Why you manipulating her? Why you being narcissist? Why? You got to ask yourself that why. Then you got to ask yourself, what is wrong with me? Oh, y'all don't want to get into that. I wonder why they call me. But y'all don't want to get into that. Y'all don't. Vision. SVS Vision calling me, though. This is the vision, love. It's the vision, yo. I'm trying to tell y'all. That is the... Let me tell you a secret real quick. Don't, don't say I never told you nothing, bro. Love.
love. If you want to work at your greatest version, first of all, get right with yourself. Get right with God. Come into love. Fill your cup up so that you can fill others. That is what it's all about. If you want to unlock the key to life, that's there what it's all about. Elevating, spreading love, helping one another. That's what we're supposed to be doing so that we can all elevate. It's coming out strong because I'm really like, I'm really trying to tell y'all the key to life right now, bro. The key, that's the secret. That's what we here for. If you keep wondering to raise the frequency, to raise the vibration of this planet so that we can come to heaven on earth. Come into harmony. That's a lot of beans spilt right here in this one little podcast, yo. That's the motion. That's the play. Everybody partying like it's... Like the, I don't know. Everybody partying like it's the end of the world. Y'all making it the end of the world, bro. I'm not saying we can't go out and enjoy ourselves. Don't get me wrong. But don't forget the focus. Don't forget the purpose. To elevate your soul. That's where love come in at. Love is the... I don't know if I just said this, but love is the... Another, another, another key, bro. Love is the highest frequency. Vibration. And you can't just fake it. You can't fake it. You, like, you gotta really love yourself, bro. You gotta really love people around you. You gotta really, like, like I said, once you fill your cup up, you gotta really start spreading it. Take me as an example, bro. I kept I kept trying to spread a message, but yet I kept pouring too much of my cup out. A balance is needed. Everyone wants love. That is the important thing. Why keep fighting each other if everybody wants the same thing? You have to sit and ask yourself that. Why are we segregated? Why is everybody hungry if we we the ones on the world that got the money? Money goes around. Why 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 is it people starving? Why why are we struggling? Huh? We putting too much thought into possessions and money and not realizing that <laughs> Once you, like I said with the celebrity thing, once you get to a high point, why why aren't you giving back? Why don't you see like, oh I'm a, I'm a, I'm a rough I'm a t shake some bones, but literally, it's okay for me to um, express myself, right? I can go uh, put on some clothes and express that. But I'm not expressing it in a way that I'm taunting my money and I see people who in need and I'm not even, like, I'm just enjoying. You feel me? It's, it's about connecting one another. That's love. Love is connecting. Love is unconditional. Love is loving that enemy that hurt you love is forgiving love is pushing forward even when you just can't because you love yourself right and you don't want to see you don't want to see yourself down and if you love yourself then you love the next person because you don't want to see them down because they are a part of you we came from a source, one source, baby. So how can I treat you any any different? I had to learn. I had to. I had to learn some humbleness a little bit too. Cause you know, once you start unlocking things, and you just like, oh my gosh, like yeah, I, yeah, I got the recipe, but. <laughs> 
it's not for you to taunt. It's not for you to not show love, not spread that wisdom to others, not to keep it to yourself. But I keep um, putting me in the picture because this is real life experience. This is the things that I had to experience in order to get to where I am. A part of me, higher part of me. And we still going. Trust me, this is not it. But for me to love to sit here is unconditional love. For y'all, for me, for everybody. You feel me? I don't got much more to say. I just want y'all to know that everybody wants love. I want y'all to realize what everybody go home at night and think about. Someone to love. <laughs> I'm just saying, fam. I'm not saying, like, obsess over somebody and obsess over yourself. That way, that person will come to you because you are so obsessed with yourself. I'm dropping jewels, bro. I'm not dropping jewels for you to take these jewels and manipulate somebody and or spread fake love. Like, nah. If you feel it in your heart, you feel it in your heart. If it's not the time for you to spread that love, hold it in and, and fill your cup up. Get all the info you need about love and, and life. And then... Take that little light of love that you got. This little light of mine. I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine. For real. But that's all I got to say. Um, I could always, I could always say more. So much more to say. If I forgot something, of course, I'll, it'll come out one day. You know what I'm saying? But that's what everybody wants. And you can't sit up here and tell me that's not what everybody wants. That's why I, I, I see so much going out in the world. So much darkness spreading. It needs to be some light. It needs to be some light. So I know that the darkness is going to want to be like, oh, what the hell is she talking about? Blah, blah, blah. But you'll see. You'll see. We all shall see soon. But thank you for being here. Make sure you connect to the most high so you can understand what I'm saying. If you if you haven't, uh, if you struggling Understanding what I'm saying, ask the most high to uh, break it down for you in a way that you can understand. I try my best, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I feel like I metaphorically get things out as I should, picture-wise, voice-wise, hearing-wise. So, whatever you need to do, like do it. Come from a place of love, though. Whatever you do, come from a place of love. What would God do? Come from a place of love. Anything you do, ask yourself first. What would God do? What would love do? Before you make any choice, yo, I'm, I'm telling you, bro. What would God do? And um, that's it. <laughs> comment subscribe and make sure y'all come back because i will be here podcast vibes we loving it like peace